Places like this in Charlotte there in the Carolinas have some people too scared to jump on amusement park rides. And that's why tonight Ariane Daytil is verifying who is in charge of making sure that roller coasters stay safe. For many of us, a trip to the amusement park isn't complete without a ride on a roller coaster. But two recent incidents have people questioning their safety. In June, a popular roller coaster at Carowinds in North Carolina was shut down after a crack was found in a support beam. And two days later, a roller coaster at a festival in Wisconsin malfunctioned, leaving passengers on the coaster upside down for several hours. That's led some people to wonder who's responsible for making sure roller coasters are actually safe. So let's verify. Are roller coasters federally regulated? Our sources are the International Association of Amusement Parks and Attractions, Amusement Ride Injury Lawyer, American National Standards Institute, Safer Parks, a nonprofit founded to help prevent amusement ride accidents, and Carolyn McLean, a consultant and public relations strategist with the amusement park industry. The short answer here is no. There is no federal agency or laws that are in place to oversee amusement parks and their rides whether they're at a permanent location or at a traveling carnival. But that doesn't mean there isn't any oversight. According to the Amusement Ride Injury Lawyer, a law firm that handles cases related to amusement park injuries, it's up to the states to decide how to regulate the rides. The International Association of Amusement Parks and Attractions says 44 of the 50 U.S. states do have regulations for parks and rides in fixed locations, like Six Flags, Cedar Point, and Disney World. Carolyn McLean, an amusement park consultant, says state regulators typically come and inspect the rides just before the park opens for a new season each year. So what kind of safety guidelines are in place for roller coasters? Many amusement parks choose to follow a set of design and safety standards established by the American National Standards Institute. Safer Parks says 35 states reference ANSI standards in their park regulations. But according to McLean, the responsibility to keep rides safe falls on the park itself. She says each roller coaster comes with its own manual and manufacturer's guidelines. It's the park's responsibility to open that up and know every word backwards and forwards so that every single day when they do their daily operations, that manual is being followed. So we can verify, no, roller coasters aren't federally regulated. But authorities in most states oversee the safety of amusement park and carnival rides. With your Verify, I'm Ariante Till. And all we can do is hope. If there's anything you'd like for us to verify, send us a message. 12 News Now, verify at 12newsnow.com. You can also find us over social media. When we